At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It's Chelsea facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Number 19, Mason Mount. Number 29, Kai Havertz. And number 17, Raheem Sterling. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. Kepa stands between the posts. Kadidu Koulibaly plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Mason Mount plays with Raheem Sterling out wide. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson is the goalkeeper. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And providing the main goal scoring threat today is Erling Haaland. And the match begins. Might really be able to trouble them here. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Rodri. Gundogan. De Bruyne. And Grealish. Gundogan. Foden. Mateo Kovacic. Sterling has it. Here's Kovacic. Silva. And now Havertz. Cross blocked. Well, it's a team full of stars, and you never quite know who is going to pop up and shine. Perhaps, Stuart, it'll be Raheem Sterling today. Well, Derek, we know his movement is very clever, but it's the speed of that movement that causes defenders... Oh, so big chance here! Can he find the net? Oh, there's the goal! That gives City the lead in the final! Will it prove to be decisive? Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. So Chelsea get the game restarted. How will they respond to that goal? Sterling. City pushing forward with options available. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Mount now with Jorginho Mateo Kovacic it is now with Jorginho and they stopped them in their tracks Holland might be able to get in behind the defence Gundogan Perfect challenge.
Kevin De Bruyne. De Bruyne. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. That's very effective, good high pressing. Thiago Silva on to Jorginho Gundogan Gundogan Phil Foden now well that pass easy on the eye cleared away Rodri Gundogan it's with Gundogan it's a perfect challenge Havertz on to Holland and back with Gundogan Grealish well, technically offside, but not by a lot. <laughs> Mateo Kovacic. Sterling has it. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. And giving it away. Gundogan. De Bruyne. Phil Foden now. Just the challenge that was required. Sterling on to Holland. Nicely timed tackle. Now he's given us away. Jorginho. This is Thiago Silva. Mateo Kovacic. Sterling. And return to Kovacic. Jorginho. On to Mount. Kovacic. He has time to play it over. Holland Gundogan Holland on to De Bruyne splendid defending and it needed to be Jorginho and the referee's whistle we've reached the halfway point here at Wembley Stadium So back in business here, City with the lead, but they won't be taking anything for granted. Bad pass. Kai Havertz. Here's Kovacic. Trevor Shalaba. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle.
Havertz. Mount. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. But then the one that fails to hit its target. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. They need to get bodies back. Can he open them up here? Oh, fine stop. Thiago Silva. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. Holland. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Mount. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. Mount. A sloppy pass. Holland. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Jorginho. Here's Kovacic. Strong play here. This could be the equaliser. Oh, a goal it is! The equaliser in this final. What next in the drama? Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Grealish. Gundogan. Here's Grealish. Laporte. It's with Joao Cancelo. City move it forward with purpose. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Havertz. Looking for Sterling. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Chilwell. And a very good challenge. Into the final 20 minutes. Holland. And there's the feed into the box. Oh, a goal! As they forge ahead on this massive occasion, feel the passion. Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect. And De Bruyne's strike is absolutely perfect. Pace, power and accuracy. What a player he is. A dramatic moment near the end and that might well be the decider so they need to get tighter here well, wilting under the pressure and now they try to go forward Ball played nicely. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Oh, 
Trevo Shalaba. The onus is on Chelsea to be positive with time running out. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Joao Cancelo. Gundogan. And he did well to cut it out. Mount. Obama Yang. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? He has time to play it over. Well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? All hands on deck. And an example of a counter attack that went nowhere. This could square the game, but no, thanks to the goalkeeper, opportunity not taken. Well, you're absolutely right, Derek, the keeper's done really well there, but really that should have been the equaliser, and there's not long left now. Trying to pick out a teammate, struggling to get it away. Obama Young, he must finish! And turned onto the woodwork. Mount. The supporters want to see him have a go. Oh, a goal to level it up in the closing stages. Who's going to claim the trophy? It's an open question here. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Rodri. Now with Silva. Laporte. And it's Ruben Diaz. Rodri. Can they nudge in front late on here? That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up. Well, the ball rolling again here. The first period of extra time and you've got to wonder to what extent fatigue will play a part in this now. It's been an extremely competitive 90 minutes. Number 17, Kevin De Bruyne. Mateo Kovacic. It's with Cody Bali. Chilwell. And Mount. And Aubameyang making the move with the ball at his feet. What's he going to do next? Racing forward, trying to catch them out. All in all, a broken counter attack. Pulisic has it, tremendously strong in the tackle. Mount. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, perfect tackle. Erling Haaland looking for that final pass looking for the goal that would put them ahead I think I spoke too soon wasn't the best of passes finally Mount and now with Aubameyang wanted to keep it but couldn't Haaland
with Aubameyang. Mount. And clears the danger. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. Bernardo Silva. Delightful pass. Mares and crossed low into the area. Credit to them for winning back possession. Half time in extra time, and still they are level. Well, the second period of extra time commences. What drama do we have in store for us? And with that, the attack fizzles out. Havertz. Can they grab the lead late on? Bernardo Silva. Well, the counter chance looks very real. determined defending time is fast running out five minutes left and the second period of extra time here Havertz bit of a sloppy pass by Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang Rodri and now it's Phillips Laporte Foden and a chance to whip it in here could be magnificent goalkeeping and still their level well it's a top save and it's an important one as well Derek that would have been it had that gone in Now sending it in. Oh, cleared off the line. Alert defending. Well, a fantastic final. And it's going to end in the most nerve-shredding way possible with a penalty shootout. This will test the mentality of any footballer. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. And he steps up to take his penalty. And it wasn't the greatest penalty. And it's been saved by the keeper. He might be wishing that hadn't been his plan of attack. And confidently converted. Can he get the better of the keeper? Oh, a superb save. And he scores! And that is when you need your goalkeeper. And now he knows what's on the line. If he scores, they win. Oh, that's it! The final act in the drama. One team jubilant, the other distraught. Well, what an end into a very good tournament, and I think they fully deserve to win it. Maybe not in this manner, though, but it was great entertainment. It certainly was, and they're not going to forget this in a hurry.
a proud moment for everyone involved with the club but for their opponents it's a case of trying to forget and move on as quickly as possible well i think we should give them some credit too they played their part in what was an excellent contest some of their football was brilliant yes fair play stewart the party in full swing now it's going to be quite the night of celebration here